Powder coating is all around us. People are exposed to powder coating without even knowing it. It can be in your office setting, the lights over your head, the stapler that you use on your desk, in your car, your rims, uh, at home. You know, there's wrought iron furniture, patio furniture. Those are all powder coated. I mean, the list can go on. Powder coating is the superior coating. It's not just used for functionality anymore, but it's also used to design and capture a spectrum of colors and textures and effects. And so nowadays you'll see the art actually created strictly with powder coating. It's colorful, it stays colorful. It's safe around the kids, it's safe around the pets. It's trouble free. It's something that I can set it and forget it. The application process is typically less expensive than your conventional coatings. Recoating is lower. The need to replace components is reduced. So it's not just an upfront cost savings, it's a down the line cost savings as well. At Sundial, we want to make sure that when a consumer or commercial account decides to use Sundial, that their product is going to be safe, it's going to come out as expected with our state-of-the-art equipment and our continual efforts to train and educate our staff on the best application processes will yield the best product for our customer. And having been here for 30 years and being the only seven stage pre-treatment powder coating shop, as well as being the first PCI 3000 certified coder in Southern California are things that we do on a continual basis. When the material is brought to Sundial's factory, the actual process begins by preparing the metal. There's two common approaches that are taken. One is using a sandblasting process, which removes the existing coatings. And a second process is the seven stage pre-treatment system that allows it to increase the adhesion of the powder coating. Once the material has been prepared to receive powder coating, the parts travel into a paint booth. The powder coating is dry and it adheres to the product using an electrostatic charge. The powder becomes an armor coating on that part. As it turns into a liquid state, it starts to fill in the crevices and cross-link into one continuous coating around your parts. As it comes out to the other end of it all, you start to see a finished product. And cool thing about powder coating is after it gets out of the oven that's it and once it cools down it's as hard and as uh, cured as it's going to be for the rest of its life it's ready to roll